according to the Palestinian Ministry of Health. There are about 1,900 people that have died, while 7,696 have been wounded in the war against Hamas, as the ground invasion from Israel, of course, is imminent. Remember, viewers, uh, this is, of course, the latest statistics that we're tracking for all of you as far as um, the casualties in Gaza is concerned. Uh, a total of 3,200 lives have been claimed till now as the war continues. Remember, about a week back, Hamas terrorists had fired uh, uh, more than 5,000 rockets against Israel uh, and, of course, also infiltrated Israel and murdered innocent civilians. Israel has retaliated and in the retaliation, 1,900 people have died. This is, of course, a statistic from the Palestinian Ministry of Health. Joining me on the broadcast for war is my colleague Arzu Seth. Arzu, over to you. What details can you provide us on the latest statistic from Gaza? Uh, well, please remember Israeli's army chief uh, on Thursday said that the Gaza Strip, which is ruled by Hamas, was hundreds of been flattered by the Israeli's militant air strike that began after the deadliest attack by Hamas on the Jewish nation on Saturday. Even uh, uh, Gaza's humanitarian crisis is deepening with the warning people are at the risk, risk of starvation. And now the data has been released over the death of the Gaza. At least 1,900 people have been killed by Israeli strike in Gaza following the deadly Hamas attack last Saturday. Uh, according to the, this is the, you know, according to the Palestinian Ministry of Health, the toll includes 614 children and 70 women. Officials said an additional uh, 7,696 people have been wounded, uh, according to the ministry. And you know, so, uh, in fact, Israel has dropped about more than 6,000 bombs against Hamas targets in Gaza. The country's air force said and found the pictures emerging from Gaza showed massive damage and destruction all around. The air force too shared some pictures that showed crumbled buildings with barely a few people inside. So this could be clearly seen that the number of dead souls are increasing day by day as the you know war enters the eighth day and as the you know the number of days are increasing the death toll from both the sites are increasing, whether it's from Israel or from Gaza Strip. Yes. All right, Arzu, with that, I would like to thank you for joining us on the broadcast. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.